Hi, it's me, Vita Marilisi again. Hello, and today we've got an unboxing of a new box that I haven't tried yet, which is called Fable Merch. It's what Wick and Fable used to be, and now they've gone to the Fable Merch boxes. It's the first time I've got it, and it is the December box. And yes, I know we're in March, um, but this just arrived. <laughs> um, there was a lot of delays and everything, and I think it's come without the pin and the keychain as well, so that will probably have to be added in later um because you saw there was a lot a lot of problems with the fact that when they first had it made their supplier just messed it up it looked really bad so they had it redone which i have no problem with um and i'm quite excited it came in a big box so i'll have to see what's inside so first thing is i've opened it because there's no way i'm trying to open it oh pretty so we've got this lovely I think, by the looks of it, it's like a whiteboard. That's really cool, because then you can put like what I need to read, and then like how many pages you've read, and everything like that. I like that, and I love the design of it, and it's quite unique. It's not something you see in any box. Which would explain why the box itself was so big that it came in. So, <laughs> yeah. That's really cool, I like that. I like that, I like it, I like it. Second is this. Ooh, what's this? So it's kind of like, oh, it's like a neckchief, which is Spin the Dawn. I don't know, I saw that and I kind of thought, oh my goodness, it's Rapunzel. Because like, look, it's kind of like rapunzel -y, isn't it? Yes, it's kind of like rapunzel -y, but it's not. Um, so that's Spin the Dawn. I like it. It's really cool. And it's really nice material as well. If you look at it, it's like proper nice material and it's been edged properly. Yes, those little things do count to me been edged properly so that is a good quality piece of material you know really, really nice i like that it's a good quality um next we have oh the main event here. i'm just gonna check there isn't anything else nope so we have our lovely candle box here and i'm going to show you all the sides so that is a lot smaller than i've seen it on um on photos and stuff so you look that's how small it is look how small it is Tiny, it's like the width of my hand. So from all sides, we've got obviously the top there. We've got, oh, it's really sweet, isn't it? And then you've got Spin the Dawn. I think that's winter. I'm not quite sure. And then that one as well. I don't quite know what all of them are, but it's based, it's some um, fairy tale retellings. So let's have a little look, see what. Oh, there you go. That's that. So it's all packed up. I'm guessing. Yeah, we go. So that's just the candles, and you've got one thing in there as well. You've got the little spoiler there. I opted for the deluxe box because I thought if I'm gonna do this, I've got to do everything and see exactly what they're like. But obviously, in the future, if I like it, I can always get the essentials. So far, I am really liking it. Um, so I'll tell you the difference between both of them in a minute. But first of all, we have ooh, the rampant crew. Even in the future, the story begins once upon a time. So this is um, the Cinder series. Got a lovely little candle there. And I love the art on it as well. And the smell. Ooh, it's kind of like... It's kind of like spicy. It's got a spicy smell to it. Like, like Christmas spice. Like sweet but spicy. And then we've got... Emberfall, one of my favourite series. That's our little Emberfall there. Again, really cute design. Um, have you not figured it out yet? The curse torments us all. Mm. It's kind of airy. It is like... It smells like a store... It, this sounds really weird, but it smells like a, um, like a fairy tale. You know, kind of like airy fairy, but at the same time... Just like woody, like na naturally, naturally, natural, naturally. You know what I mean? So that's really cool. And that is the two ounce candle. So these ones are the two ounce ones. These small, lovely little small ones. And now we have the four ounce ones. So first we've got City of Starlight, and I'm sure you can guess where that's from. So that's our lovely design there. I love the designs on these. They're so cool. This is the first time I've ever got their candles as well, apart from kind of in other book boxes and stuff. So, ooh, 
It's like sweet, but it's, it's like florally sweet. I really like that. It's flor. It, that's really lovely. And look, they're all done really well and stuff. So that is the four ounce candle. That's how big that one is. And then our last four ounce candle is Princess of Desai. I'm hoping this one's going to smell a bit better than the one over there, I know, because that one was really sour. It's possible to be strong and yielding at the same time. So we've got a little artwork there of our Princess of Desai. It's kind of like a, a sweet... I don't know how to describe that. You know in the way that like licorice smells sweet? It's that kind of scent. But I like it. I like it. It's cute. And then, oh, we got other stuff. We got other stuff at the bottom of the box. Ah! Oh, we got more than other stuff at the bottom of the box. So we've got, oh, hello. We've got this bag. Which is really, really cool. Which, again, I can you can guess where that's from, can't you? Because I definitely can. Mm. It's really cool and it's nice quality as well. It's nice. I mean, there are other designs that I've liked more, but I I do like that. That's really cool. So yay. So that's our bag. And then I'm guessing these are the prints. It's kind of a little paper thing to keep it safe. And look, it's come with all the all the polystyrene stuff as well to keep all that safe. So we have some journeys have ends. But not this one. This one will challenge you irrevocably. I can't speak sometimes. That's one size. And the other side says the choices we face may not be the choices we want, but they are choices nonetheless. Which is from A Curse of Day Dark and Lowly. It's cool. I'm, as you probably seen in the past videos, I am not a fan of wooden bookmarks. I'm just not. But, I mean, it's, it's nice. It's a nice design. I like it. But... I'm just not a fan of wooden bookmarks. And then we've got these lovely character arts, which I might add on the back. It's got that, which is really cute. So I have no idea who these characters are. Um, so I think, I think this is the Cinder series. So we've got, I'm guessing, Little Red Riding Hood. And then Snow White. And then I want to say Mulan. And then maybe winter. Eh, don't think that's right. Probably, maybe Cress. I'm not. I'm, I'm not 100 sure, but they're really cute. Look at them. I like them. I like them. So the big difference, obviously, on this one because it is the first time I've done this box. I will explain these things to you. So first of all, this is the anniversary box. It says, which is really cool. The difference between the deluxe box and don't worry, I will put them up here. So. In the essentials box, you get two ounce candles, so two two ounce candles. You get the keychain slash enamel pin design, which obviously is coming at a later date. You get the um, tote bag, you get the double sided wooden bookmark, and the character cards. Now, the obviously there is that one's about twenty five dollars, if I'm correct. I went for the deluxe box, which was a lot more. I will put the prices up there as well, just to show the difference. So, in the deluxe box, extra on top of the essentials, you get two four ounce candles. Um, you get the, obviously, to be read dry eraser board, which was really, really cool. So you get a, kind of like a big item. Um, you get the silky scarf, which was the spin the dawn one at the beginning. Um, so those are the, so those three. Ah, so those three. Okay, so those are the three extras you get. Which is still, which is really, really cool to be honest. I like the extras in there. That's cool. Obviously, I've put the, I'll put the prices up there so you can see the difference. I really like this box. I think it's really sweet the way they've done it. And yes, I will be getting again. Um, the expensive obviously means that I would probably only get it if I really, really like the box. <laughs> because getting it to the UK is a lot of money. Um, that, you know, it's, I think it's something like $70 in total, obviously prices will be there, so you'll know what it actually is, um, which is, you know, it was about 50 quid, it's a lot of money to get it over, but 
if I do a fandom that I really like, yes, I will definitely get again and I will be very excited to get the box. So yes, I recommend. It was definitely worth the wait, even if the wait was slightly annoying, but understandable. Um, I can't wait to see the keychain in person. I will upload a video on that as well to show you what it looks like and look at my Instagram because I will definitely be taking photos when it comes in. And I hope you like the video. So yes, recommend this box. Totally love it. My favourite items have to be this candle because I mean look at the gorgeousness of that and oh I have to admit yeah I love it I love it I love the board I love the board I love the board so yeah these are my three favorite um I hope you're having a good week and obviously stay safe with all this happening at the moment which is just crazy I don't know why but there's no flower in the shops yep there's no hand sanitizer and no flower no idea why um we're self-isolating at the moment me and my boyfriend which is fun um reading loads of books so <laughs> that's at least one thing um but yeah and um you know stay safe and hopefully i will have more unboxes coming for you guys so maybe we'll kind of kill a bit of time as well feel free to watch back all the other ones i've done as well just saying something to do and i'll see you guys soon with another unboxing stay safe and have a good month